Hey guys, this is Shannon with Nearly Organic Noshing, and I decided I wanted to try and give the chicks just a little bit more space. This is what I had been taking them um, out in the yard in, is just this little dog kennel, and I'd remove the bottom from it. And it's fine. Um, it works perfectly, perfectly well. But I looked and we had received this box and, <coughs> excuse me, it had a freezer door in it. And I thought, you know, that looks to be about the same size as the top to um, my water trough. I have a, a stock tank that this um, lid fits perfectly that the girls stay in right now, that the babies stay in. So I measured it to the top and it is just about um, a perfect fit. It's a tiny bit short on this side, which I'll probably just even it up and scoot it down a little bit on the side. And I went ahead and brought out some of these panels right here just in case it was a little bit off. Um, I could go ahead and, and put that on the ends if I needed to. But all I did is I folded up all of the flaps to give the box some rigidity and so that there was no chance that the box would fall in and then I just set the lid um, that goes to the stock tank right on top of the box because it's not heavy it's just um, wire and then just a little these these boards these thin boards to make the frame for it so it just sits right on top and I'm gonna go grab their water out and put their water in here and um, let them have a little bit of outside grass time um, pecking around you know before they I put them back in the in their stock tank which is their their temporary brooder home for now so I just thought I would give you another option um, for taking the your, your chickens outside to give them some outside time it just sets flat on the ground just fold the edges up and I put my top just right on top of it. And like I said, I'll probably lay those pieces. Um, this is actually from my son's guinea pig and it's in sections. And when the chicks are really small, you can take this outside if you're sitting right with them and make them a little barrier and let the babies run around some. But we don't do that very much just because they're, you know, of the temperature and them getting outside. But um, I'm just gonna lay those pieces right here across the end just to be on the safe side of not letting anything in or them getting out. Um, they, they couldn't get out, but the dogs might be able to get their nose up under the edge and shove this. So this is just another little option. If you wanna do, take a big box, <laughs> put, take the bottom out and take them outside so they can get some sunshine, fresh air and grass. Okay guys, I hope this helps and I will talk to you later.